You know, I think um, my focus here is just obviously to do the best I can. I think I really want to just keep improving. I think, uh, you know, I trained hard this off season, but, um, you know, there's a lot to learn once you get back in the swing of things and you're skating more and, you know, learning the systems and stuff like that. I think, uh, you know, I, I uh, you know, took it a lot last year, especially when I was injured, and I'm trying to implement that into my game now. So I think, uh, uh, you know, my focus here is just, just uh, you know, soak a lot in and try to fix some of the habits that um, I didn't like as much in my game last year. Um, some stuff in the D zone. I think, um, you know, just being more responsible and smarter, I guess, and not jumping in when I don't have to, uh, and like closing on guys at the right time, I guess. And then also, I want to try to shoot the puck more. I worked a good amount of my shot this summer, so I think, uh, you know, I'm more confident in it, and hopefully I can, uh, you know, use that confidence and shoot more, especially when I'm in the slot and good areas. I think uh, that's really important for me to take my game to the next level. I, I, I focus a little more on my upper body and just uh, trying to get stronger so I can you know work on my shot. Obviously, most of the game is legs, but uh, I think for me, uh, you know, having more stability and power upper body uh, will come in handy during the season, especially playing against bigger guys and stuff like that. So, spend a little more time on that and just uh, you know some of the mechanics of my shot and things like that too. Yeah, I mean it did a little bit. I think. Uh, you know, I was here for a while doing so much rehab that, uh, you know, it, it uh, healed up quickly, and, which, was, which was really good. And I think, uh, you know, that really helps being around the rink and sort of having rehab as my full-time job there for a bit was, uh, you know, helpful to help me get back quicker and be able to get a good amount of work in, in the summer. Um, yeah, yeah. I, I am now. I think, uh, you know, at first when I started skating, it was a little, it's a little weird, a little, like, uh, creaky or something, just working through some of that stuff. I think the motion of shooting is a little, a little awkward at the start, but that comes back quickly. And as I said, I did so much rehab here that it was a pretty smooth transi transition once I got skating. Yeah, no, definitely. I think, uh, you know, those guys, seeing their success, it was uh, inspiring to me for sure, especially, you know, we're pretty close friends, all of us, all the younger guys. And, I mean, the whole team was pretty close, but especially the group of younger guys kind of... Uh, you know, stuck together there, and uh, you know, because it's it's definitely a transition. So I think uh, seeing them have success and seeing them sort of break through, you know, at different times and really, uh, you know, play with confidence and really have an impact on a lot of games was was really cool and inspiring. I think to me and a lot of other younger guys too. Yeah, I mean, of course, I think uh, you know, if I'm lucky enough to play with Bergie or you know, Marshy, that would be you know incredible. I think. Uh, you know, I'm not I'm not trying to not expecting anything like that. Obviously, I think I'm just trying to, you know, do the best I can, and um, you know, trying to be more versatile too. Like being able to play different roles, I think is is big, and you know, being to play in the middle of the ice a little bit too would be, you know, good for my game. You know, not necessarily like taking a ton of faceoffs or something, but just in the D zones areas like that. So I think, uh, you know, I think um, having an open mind coming into camp is important because. Uh, you know, you want to be there for the team, whatever they need, you want to be able to adapt, and that's something I'm trying to focus on for sure. It's, uh, you, you try to get some good skates in towards the end of the summer for sure, like with more contact, but uh, it's always been ramped up because guys are competing for jobs here. So I think that was good. I think it was it's good for all of us to uh, get that high pace. I mean, it's obviously a weird camp this year with the guys in China, but, um, you know, I guess... In a way, we can get a, get a few more reps or something like that with the split camps here right now. So I think uh, you know we gotta take the positives out of it for sure. Yeah, no, yeah, I think so for sure. I think uh, you know, I think uh, the, especially the Matt Martin hit, which people you know bring up a good amount, was you know I sort of had my head down there, and uh, you know, that's something that I think the veteran guys are more aware of, like who's on the ice, and you know when you're. Coming up with speed of the middle of the ice, you gotta you know, have a quick reaction time and be ready to, you know, move out of the way if someone's coming because you you gotta be aware where someone might be. So I think, um, you know, that along with just building my strength up, you know, and uh, sort of trying to engage first. Yeah. Uh, 